I'm Hamish, but a lot of people like to call me 25 by T. Okay, now Reva Soldier, now Reva Dinos. Let's get started. So, I don't want to waste no time. You face time, make sure you subscribe right here, okay? Right here, subscribe to my channel. Let's get started. So, now they say they see the ice in beverage tall. Oh, so they say it's tall, whether it's tall ice in beverage or like beer, wine, and soft drinks. So, it's a complete line of beer. Oh, this is a complete line of beer. Wine and soft drink products. Products means one beer soft drink. Below are quantities. Means like, okay, for beer, okay, each beer probably costs 19 rand. But how many of them this guy buy? 60,000. Okay, 2008. But at 2010, we see the price kind of change. He went to 21.5 for one beer. But how many beer did the guy drink? He drink less, maybe. Not a problem. Same here, wine, wine 2008, it costs 22, but how much? 30,000. And same here, 2000, etc. etc. Just like how we see soft drink is more cheaper. And so he bought a lot of soft drink. But 2010, the price kind of increased. So now they want us to, uh, to solve this question. You know what I'm saying? By using what? Uh, the Posh Price Index. And also you have to use uh, last prayers, price index. So they give you this formula most of the time, but if they don't, then you can memorize. You know what I'm saying? So now if you look at the formula, we need to have P N Q N. But what is P N? Now let's go. P naught Q naught. P naught means that this year because we got two years here. There's a change of the price and quantity from 2008 to 2010. Okay. So this price when initial started, this is gonna call P naught. Oh so for beer, this is P0. You know what I'm saying? So the quantity here that you're going to start with is going to be Q0. So this is like a Q0 here. I'm going to write Q0. Uh, I think you understand. So let's, let's say this is Q0. Let me write here. Okay, this is Q0. Let's make this one. So this is like Q0. Okay, so this. Oh, Q0. Q0 means Q0. So here means things start to change. So since things start to change, so this is going to be QN, PN because of price. PN and this is going to be QN, 2010. So now, they want to use uh, this formula, page now. So what do we need to read? PN means, PN is like 2010, means increase. And for price, and this quantity N means quantity of, so that means what? P0 means here, so etc, etc. So we got beer, whatever, whatever you have. So now, the question is gonna come like, oh, so which one now I'm gonna take for kilo to for what, what? So we're gonna have to use the formula to involve all of them, okay? So we know this one is 10 for summation. So now, let's come here. Now we're gonna sum. So, I wanna come here to form. Let me find, uh, excuse me, so. Let me start phase, uh, okay. Okay, let me find this, let me find this. Let's start with the partial print. So let's find PN, Q naught, PN, Q naught, okay. So let's find PN, P0 means, let's get this one because this formula we want to calculate the phase. P naught, Q naught, or in other words, this one say P, P naught, QN, excuse me. Let's start today. We can even start at the one on top, but let's start with this. So this MSA, what is P0? P0 is like 2018. And then uh, quantity, 2010. Now, let's get those, okay? So what is the, uh, so now we go now. Also here, PNQN means, because I want to break down this. PNQN, what is PN? Is it PN? QN is MSA P, 2018. And quantity. Oh, I'm sorry. PN, PN means what is PN? PN means price of 2010. 2010. What can I say here? Let me write here. Let me write here. Excuse me. PN, QN. So let me say price N means 2010. And quantity 2010. Okay, now, so we can calculate this formula here for the top. Now let's come here for the second one. PNQ0. Oh, let's have the one with the, uh, 
So yeah, PN to not means PN to not. So it doesn't matter, I can either start with either one. So for this one here, for this formula, because this one is like we have all of them, PN, QN, we can get here. PN, QN, all the information, whatever. So now we come for the second one. The second formula for last prayer pre price means you have a PN, Q naught. So here I'm going to say PN, Q naught. And this one I say, what is N? N is like a price of 2010. Because that's like increase N. So we say price of 2010. Another way. Price of 2010. And then we multiply. This is like a multiplication here. You can say multiplication. You can say multiplication. Okay. Q naught means quantity. 2008. Excuse me, my apologies. Now we go for the last one. If I want to use the formula, I have to get this P naught, Q naught. What is P naught? Price. No, Q naught, which same as say, uh, P, price of 2018, times quantity of 2018. Okay, now let's work it out now. Cool. So now if you start for beer, because we got different type price. For beer, we have a P naught. What is a P naught for beer? For beer is 19. So say 19 times quantity N times 5,000. Oh, so 19 times 5,000. So 19 times 5,000, 1, 2, 3. And this is going to give us uh, 9, 5, 3, 0. 9, 5, 2, 0. 9, 5, 1, 2, 3. So that's it for, uh, for what? For, for B. Now let's go for wine. For wine, also P0, Q. So we say oh, P0 means price 0 times QN. QN of the beer uh, is 5,000. So 32. Uh, times 5,000 and this is going to give us uh, it's going to give us uh, 1640 16 16 16 16 1 2 3 4 now let's go for the last one for the last of soft drink P0 means 6 times QN what is a QN so 6 times so 6 6 times 1 1 1 2 3 and this is going to give us uh, 6, 6, 1, 2, 3. Now let's go for a second one. PN, QN. Okay, but let's start for beer. PN, QN for beer. What is price N? Price N, this. Times QN because PN, QN. So, channel 1, point five times 5,000. And this is going to give us. 10, 0, 7, 500. 10, 0, 7, 500. Okay, cool. Drink some water, excuse me. Okay. Now we go. PN, Q naught. What is a PN? For beer. For beer, PN means this price here. To the one fifteen times Q naught. Q naught means quantity zero times three thousand, and this gonna give us excuse me times five thousand, and this gonna give us a uh, uh, PN Q naught. I think I'm gonna say this. You know, one fifty times. You know, one fifty times. Okay, times Q naught. What is a Q naught? Quantity naught equals six thousand. I'm wrong. Uh, for BA, yeah, 6,000, excuse me, it's 6,000, 6,000, because P, N, price, N, channel 150, times quantity 0, 106,000, okay, cool, we got it, so when you plug in the calculator, that's going to give us 129, 0, 120, 9, 1, 2, 3, now let's go for the last one, so for the last one, it means P naught, what is a P naught? For beer, right now, or beer, you know what I'm saying? So, if I have a P naught, what is a P naught? Price naught, 19. Okay, times uh, quantity naught. Quantity naught means 2150. 2150. 19 times. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. Q naught, quantity naught. What is a quantity naught? For, for beer, quantity naught. P naught, price naught. 
price note for beer 19 and quite note 6000 okay we got 6000 I'm wrong here 6000 6000 and this is gonna give us a uh, 114 one, 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 two, three. now let's go now quick now for one okay now for one PNQN PNQN means 35 times half hour 35 times 5,000 and this will give us 105 105 okay now for y okay y, pn for y pn plus a the five pn q note the five times quantity note 3,000 Okay, and this, the five, it's going to be, okay. The five, thirty thousand, and then it's going to give us ten zero five, ten zero five, ten zero five, one, two, three. Okay, now we come. P not, Q not, for B, a P not, what is P not? P not, price not equal to thirty two, for one, thirty two times quantity nine, quantity nine, four, that's going to be thirty thousand. So now let's plug in the calculator. 32 times 3000. 96 people zero. Okay, now let's go for the last one. So for the last one, cold drink. For cold drink, now we go PNQN. PNQN. What is a PN? Times QN. Okay, so 75 times 11123. Okay, so this will be 82500. 82500. Now let's go for the second last. Now, PNQN for soft drink. PN 7.5 times PNQ naught. Q naught. PNQ naught. Q naught for the soft drink 9000. The calculator and plug it quick. Six seven five hundred. Six seven five hundred. Six seven. Okay. Now we go for the last one. For the last one, so P not Q not. P not Q not means six times nine thousand. And this is gonna give us fifty four. One two three. Okay. So we have all the data. Now let's go and substitute and solve the question. Easy man. So now we can get a price price also. So before we get price price means we need to get some of this because we got this but we need to get some summation. Or we can say total here, total. Total. Okay, so now we're gonna add all of this here. Means the summation now means if I sum this for the P not means I have to get some of this and some of this. So for this one, means if I add all of this, means going to be some for B, some for one, some of this. So the summation of all of them is going to give the summation of P naught Q naught. So summation of P naught or P naught Q n. What is P naught Q n? Thirty two one thousand. 32, 1, 2, 3. Now we go for the next one. So now from there, okay, P0, okay, we got this, so we got PN, QN. Sum of PN, QN, sum, PN, means this will be a wine soft drink together. And the calculator, this one give you, it's going to give you 365, 0. 365, 1, 2, 3. Okay, so now we say sum. So sum of P and Q0. It's P and Q0. Choose my head, right? Summation. P and Q0. So P and Q0, if you add all them, it's going to give you 3, 301, 500. 301, and then 500. 
Okay, the last one, sum of all of these. Pn is okay, so say sum. Okay, add all these. So how do you get this number? Means people ask me like how do I get this? This I get by taking this plus this plus this. And that's gonna give me the sum of this. Same here. This plus this plus this. Together it's gonna give me this. Same here. This plus this plus this. Get that. So now we go for the last one. Means sum of all this means sum these, these, and that. So finally, it's gonna give us 264, triple zero. Okay, which is gonna give us 264? 264 okay 264 triple zero cool so we got we got all the data so what we're gonna do we can just substitute pn qn we have this one over that and then multiply by 100 you know what i'm saying so what i'm gonna do i don't need this anymore so i can just make a space over here you know i'm saying Okay, cool. Now, let's go now. Let's start with the first one. The pass, the pass price index. The pass price index. Pass. I hope I'm pronounced correct. You can correct me if I kind of mispronounce it, no? The pass. Par. Price index. So we can get it now. Sum of all these P and Q N. Some P and Q N you got. Thirty six five thousand. Thirty five three six five thousand. Over. P not Q not sum. P not Q not. Three two one thousand. So multiply by hundred. And this won't give us uh okay. 113, 113.71. So now we go for the second one, which is uh, last press, Prince index, price index, okay? So now for the last prayer, let's, let's, let's pee, let's pray, let's pay, let's pay. Look, man, <laughs> you can laugh as much as you want. You know what I'm saying? I really don't care. <laughs> so now we say this is equal to okay PNQ not we got PNQ not we got three hundred one five thousand three hundred okay now we go P not Q not P not twenty six four thousand then the map hundred and this gonna give us plug in the calculator gonna give you 11420 11420 so this is how you calculate uh the pass pass price index and let's press price index look man you face time like face time my channel make sure you subscribe here share and like the video thanks a lot of peace and love i'm out thank you